Hi gang, welcome back to Waxing On. As you can see, we're celebrating St. Patrick's Day. Well, St. Patrick's Week, really, because we're going to feature Celtic music all week long. And today we're starting out with a group, a uh, family group, brothers and sisters together from Ireland. Uh, their music has been classified as pop rock traditional, and the band is The Corps. Very popular group very easily accessible. It's not the die-hard Celtic music, uh, like I say, a lot of uh, radio-friendly music. Uh, the pop rock part in there. Uh, we got some Celtic instruments in here. Let's take a look at the band first. <laughs> Starting off, we got Jim Corr. He's playing uh, keyboards, guitar, and vocals. We've got his sister Sharon Corr on violin and vocals. Corinne Corr on drums, Vaudrin and vocals. And finally, Andrea Coron lead vocals and tin whistle. So a few of those Celtic instruments thrown in there. Uh, this album uh, that I have is uh, Forgiven Not Forgotten. They do have an extensive catalog. And of course, you check on uh, streaming networks, lots there to find. Uh, we figured this was an easy way to kind of ease us into our St. Patrick's Day celebrations, or our St. Patrick's Day week. The group started... Uh, around 1990. They really got a big break where in 1991 they earned parts in the movie The Commitments. And from there they got representation and started to record. Now this album, I don't see a date on it right offhand. Oh, there it is, 1995. So it's quite a while ago, right? This is before the millennium. So this is way back in the early days. Now, here's what kind of songs they're doing. We got Aaron Shore, a traditional Irish tune. Uh, Forgotten Not Forgiven, Heaven Knows, Along With the Girls, Another Instrumental, Someday, Run Away, The Right Time, The Minstrel Boy, Another Instrumental Tune, uh, Toss the Feathers, Instrumental, Love to Love You, Secret Life, Caron Jig, Another Instrumental, uh, Closer, Leave Me Alone, and We're Revisiting Aaron Shore. So we've got some traditional Irish music in there, some traditional instrumental songs, as well as some tunes that they put together for this album. Now, uh, surprisingly, the band still out touring. I went on their website, but there really wasn't a lot of information on there. Um, tour dates. Right now, they don't seem to be in North America. They're over in another uh, part of the country. This produced by David Foster. Now, I remember we've talked about David Foster a few times. Uh, a master... A production, Michael Bublé, Celine Dion, people like that, Chicago. Uh, we also touched on uh, David Foster when he was a backup player for uh, Ronnie Hawkins, if you remember the Ronnie Hawkins segment we did a few weeks ago. So no stranger to uh, making stars. Um, all music with the lyrics were by the chorus, except for the Someday by David Foster in the chorus, so we got co-writing on there as well, and the traditional tunes we have. So a lot of music to kind of get us in the mood, get us started with our week. Again, check them out on uh, streaming networks. Check them out on YouTube. You can check out their website, see what you can find. There's some swag on there you can pick up, as well as uh, tour dates. And we're looking at the Corps, a sibling Irish band, to kick us off on St. Patrick's Week. There you go. We'll see you on Wednesday. We've got a raucous tune, or raucous band set up for you on that day. Uh, one of Boston's favorite sons, and some of you already know who I'm talking about. So we'll see you Wednesday for that show. Until then, everybody take care, stay safe, see you on Wednesday.